Hi, this is Michelle Cromer, and this is your Feng Shui Tip of the Week, and it is about love because we're in the month of love. I've got my hearts on, I've got my all my symbolism on, I've got my pink, I never wear red because my hair is really red, it never looks good, that's another video. But let's talk about love. You want love, you have love, we can always use more of it. So real simply, in your home, when you walk in your front door, the furthest right-hand corner is going to be your love section. Hang a wind chime or maybe a crystal and make sure you have colors in that area. Even if it's your garage, paint it pink, it doesn't matter, or red. But bring in all of the vibration of love and have some pairs, two candles or two cushions or two photographs or whatever. Just bring in that energy of partnership. In your bedroom, no matter where it is in your home, that represents your love life. Make sure you have a headboard so that your relationships are supported. Have two nightstands so that your chi is very balanced and so is your yin and your yang. And if you're looking for love, I always tell my clients to leave the drawer opposite from where you sleep completely empty and you can visualize that partner coming in and putting his or her things in that empty drawer. Don't have photographs of your family. This is your sanctuary and you wanna make sure that that is just for you and your partner. Be careful what you hang over your bed. You don't wanna have, say, an ocean because then you're sleeping underwater. Have something that's something like flowers that are growing or two butterflies indicating the strength of your future relationship. And lastly, always love yourself and then you're gonna attract the love that you want. This is Michelle Cromer, and this is your tip of the week. Please ask me questions at michelle at michellecromer.com or follow me on Facebook at Michelle Cromer Feng Shui. Thanks.